The small community of Oakdale is rich with history. Old trains, old buildings, old cars, and then there's this. Terrifying. Yeah, it's a shock every day. I actually changed the sound of it. This is a fire horn, and the blaring noise belches from the top of the Oakdale fire station three times a day. I, you know, I don't really know what it's for. The horn's calls have perked the ears of many in town. I'm here because um, somebody repaired the horn. The toots were a touchy topic in Oakdale's last city council meeting. Why? Because you know that you're in Oakdale. I, I, every time I hear it, I go, ah. Oh. Okay. Residents really didn't get a clear answer. So I went down to the source of the sound to find out. And this was a dispatch system for the fire department. Fire Captain Dan Cummins tells me that before radios and cell phones, the horn was used to alert the town of a fire. It's been operating since the early 1900s. The horn used to be controlled by this clock, but in 2005, it broke. If it went off and you're not dressed, you're going to be late for school. A lot of the old timers remember the horn. I, I hate it. And many say they didn't miss it when it broke. So now the question is, why'd they fix it? just on a traditional uh, aspect. Today, the clock's out of the picture. Now, a modified sprinkler timer runs the horn. The anticipation is killing me. <laughs> In a town known for its history, why let this one die? Hey, thanks for watching, and for more videos, click on this right here. Also, write in the comments what other stories I should be checking out.